This video was brought to you by Dollar Shave Club. Get top quality razors delivered to your door starting at just $1 a month. Link below in the description. Skip it a button, that up. So twitch.tv, it's the streaming site where a lot of people go to stream games and do Let's Plays on there and, and live streaming, is cracking down on women and men who wear virtually nothing on camera when they're live streaming to gain viewers. They're not going to allow it anymore. And you know what? Thank you, Jesus. I think it's fantastic. So let me explain what's going on. So how did it become mainstream that Twitch was changing their policies? Well, there's a rooster teeth journalist. I never even heard of her before, to be honest with you, named Meg Turney, uh, who got in trouble with Twitch because her profile picture was too provocative. At first, the story was getting blown out of proportion. They were saying she got kicked off of Twitch and all this other crap, but it was just they wanted her to change her profile picture and that's what started the ball rolling with this and made people and made people talk about it and articles were being made about it because she got in trouble on Twitch. And this is a statement from Twitch TV. This is what they had to say. Dress appropriately. Nerds are sexy and you're all magnificent, beautiful creatures. But let's try and keep this about the game, shall we? Wearing no clothing or sexually suggestive clothing, including lingerie, swimsuits, pasties, and undergarments is prohibited, as well as any full nude torsos, which applies to both male and female broadcasters. You may have a great six pack, but that's better shared on the beach during a two on two volleyball game, blasting playing with the boys. We sell t-shirts and those are always acceptable. Now, first and foremost, this has to be said, I don't have a sexist bone in my body. I know there are true female gamers out there. There's a crap ton of you, okay? And I'm sure they're not talking about if you girls out there who stream on Twitch are wearing a tank top and you're showing cleavage they don't want you to wear a towel around yourselves okay they're talking about the people who take it to extreme and i'm also not knocking a female let's player who's a genuine gamer who just happens to be attractive too you can't help the way god made you if you're good looking and it's helping you get subscribers and you're a true gamer that's great if it's helping you get viewers that's fantastic but what i'm happy is with this is to all the fucking frauds out there who wear next to nothing sometimes nothing or are completely scantily clad where they have nothing but their nipples being covered to get viewers it happens all the time on twitch i see people like people post because i don't really go to twitch that much to be honest with you but i know a lot of gamers on facebook and you see they they, tw they post like stills of these chicks that do this, okay? And again, I'm talking to these women that do this. You're not all chicks, but to these women, I use that term loosely, who basically virtually sell their ass, who probably give a shit about gaming, who were sitting there making soft core porn and just so happen to be playing video games just to get viewers. I hope this kills off your careers I, I, or your, your quote, your money making scheme, I should say, that you have on Twitch because it's bullshit and you're not about gaming. You're just about selling your ass and you just hold a controller in your hand. There was a uh, if I could find the picture, I'll post it now. There was a meme that a friend of mine posted on Facebook and I found it so true and so awesome. Now, the top girl, as you see, she's sucking on a controller like it's something else. Use your imagination. And it has her saying, mmm, sexy plastic. And next to it, it says, this is not a gamer girl. It's a slut with a controller. And on the bottom, you see this girl. Her eyes are wired. She's really into the game. And it says, this is a gamer girl. And they have a speech bubble next to her. It says, I'll shower when Hyrule is free. And that picture... I love it because it calls out the stereotype that these women who were dressing in virtually next to nothing on Twitch take advantage of. They're like, oh, guys love gaming and guys love boobs. Let me totally just take advantage of that and try to make money off of it, even though I don't give a shit about gaming. And I'm glad that Twitch is doing this, and it's going to be interesting to see what happens now that they're cracking down on these softcore porn Let's Players that were basically just robbing Twitch of money. So... It'll be interesting to see if Twitch sticks to it, though, because 
let's face it, a lot of these, you know, 13-year-old little boys were going on Twitch, and a lot of these younger guys were going on Twitch to see the tits in the games. Let's be real. So I'm very curious to see if they'll stick to it when they see the view counts go down. Because the reality of it is, a lot of people went to Twitch to see the titties. I don't know why, there's plenty of porn out there to see, but people went to Twitch to see the women with nice boobs playing video games. I personally wouldn't do it, but there was a big audience out there that did. So now, Twitch, prove that you mean it. Keep these fraud broads off of your website and stop them from making money just by showing off their asses. All right, folks, this is Rich of Review Tech USA. Make sure to rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And as always, thank you for supporting my channel. Have a good one.